Hi there, today on this uh, Millennial Review we're taking a look at the Amazon's Basics Lightweight Mini Tripod. Uh, they say that this is designed and set up for uh, you know, webcams, small cameras, point and shoots, uh, you know, action cams, but not a DSLR. I've got it here just in case to, uh, to see how it does handle. Um, but it's saying it's maximum load uh, that it recommends to use. It's about 1.1 pounds and it should be able to expand uh, from 4.76 inches in height uh, all the way to 7.5. So let's go ahead and pop it open, see what comes inside of the box uh, when it comes straight from Amazon. So we're gonna cut the bottom here and pop this guy out. So it's a nice little packaging that, uh, that Amazon sends this in. Put that to, uh, to the background there. Now inside of the box, take it out. Uh, and this is pretty sturdy. This is actually uh, quite a bit heavier than I was anticipating it to be. Um, you're going to have your legs here open up like that. So it's a nice, you know, short mounted tripod. Let's go ahead and check the height. And uh, yeah, 4.76 seems about right. And then your legs are going to be able to expand. Uh, so this is really going to allow you to uh, do something a little taller if you need to. So let's go ahead and take a look at height there. Yeah, it's not quite. Yeah, it's not quite seven and a half inches, but uh, but it's a bit over seven. Uh, so that's that's pretty neat. Up top, one of the things that uh, that made me interested in getting this is it does have a ball head style design for leveling the camera. Uh, so you're going to be able to rotate it, the little ball head, and get everything, you know, really lined up. You're also going to have this thread, threading lock nut here to make sure that when you put your camera on, so we'll take this action cam for instance, once it's tightened on, you can actually do a lock nut so that way, you know, it's not going to spin around. So, if we take a look at this here, we've got our little nut so we can level out the camera, lock it into place, which seems really secure, and there we are. Uh, so that works out pretty well. You could probably even use it as a you know pseudo selfie stick or something like that if you needed to. Um, and these legs that extend uh, definitely are a nice feature, that's for sure. Uh, so let's go ahead and level this guy out a little bit. And there we are. Look at that. So, uh, as I said, we were going to try... Huh, that's interesting. Did I not have that tight? Yeah, perfect. There we go. Yeah. So, as I said before, we're going to try out a DSLR, see how it does. I actually have faith that this will do a little better than they say it will. Um, so we've got our our Nikon camera. Go ahead and tighten this guy in. There we are. So, lock it into place here. Make sure that's nice and tight this time. Boom. Definitely holds it up. I mean, the, the one thing you have to be nervous about is it is going to be quite tippy since the, uh, the legs don't go out very far. Uh, but let's just see if it'll actually hold the camera up. Yeah, and it does hold the camera up if uh, if you go ahead and expand the uh, the legs as well. Uh, so this is a pretty nice piece, especially considering it's a really low price tag. Uh, I suspect I'll be using it quite a bit to come. And uh, thanks for watching.